Uh, Brooke, can you, can you just kind of take me through the final four and a half seconds? Um, I'm assuming that felt maybe like four and a half minutes. Yeah, it was, <laughs> it, those seconds definitely felt like they were elongated. Um, yeah, uh, I mean, it was an interesting play that Smart had there. You know, he obviously tried to make it look like he was going to shoot a free throw and then just flung it right at the rim or backboard or whatever. Um, and then the ball <laughs> just ping-ponged around, and, and the game just wouldn't end. Uh, and they did a good job trying to keep it alive. You know, I thought we did a good job trying to, uh, you know, fight for the loose ball, box out. Uh, you know, just kind of kept going their way, and they made a good play. But, uh, you know, fortunately, the time was out. Uh, just what do you think of Giannis's ability to play through such a physical game? Yeah, you know, he, he's, he's so great at just being mentally strong, even aside from, you know, all the... Uh, you know, on court uh, statistical things he does. Um, you know, he he obviously has lots of guys um, being physical with him, uh, throwing themselves at him when he's trying to you know get into his moves and uh, make plays for himself and everyone else. He, he does a great job of just sticking with it, staying in the game, and uh, you know, um, just keeping his mojo through all that. Because you know, I don't know. He, he goes through a lot out there, you know, and it can be frustrating at times. Uh, he does a great job of just, you know, kind of letting it go like water off a duck's back. Uh, just speaking of kind of that mental aspect, I think tonight he hits a couple of those push jump hooks. He hits mm -hmm. a fader. He hits lefty finger rolls. It's right-hand dunks. It, there's a lot of variety there. Just what do you think of his ability to interact with kind of the defense and then find whatever it might be that was going to be his path through. Yeah, yeah, he does a great job of that, you know, reading him what they're giving him or, you know, trying to take away whatever it is. Um, you know, and like I said, they throw a lot of different guys at him, a lot of different looks and everything like that. And he does a great job of just being smart, taking his time, uh, and, you know, either making a play for himself or someone else. After the, uh, for Giannis, just the shooting performance wasn't there in game two. Like, how would you describe him these past few days as he's sort of, like, getting ready for this game? Yeah, yeah, he was absolutely ready for the game. I think he was ready for this game right after game two. Um, you know, he was uh, very focused, um, you know, mentally composed, you know, getting his work in when we when we'd come in for practice, uh, you know, watching a lot of film, just going over a lot of stuff. He, he was definitely prepared for tonight. And that's that's just Giannis. And Brooke, um, speaking of composure, um, I mean, Bud got pretty hot <laughs> late there. Um, I guess I'll just start there. What um, I don't know. I mean, it's not. I know they, they got to work the officials, but what, what what do you get from him when he when he wants to at least do what he can? I don't know if he wanted to tech at that point or what. But what was <laughs> what was um, you know what I mean when, when he's at least going to try to do what he can? Yeah, yeah. I think it definitely gives us energy. You know, obviously uh, um, we, we've we've tried to do a, a pretty good job of um, you know just sticking within ourselves, playing for each other, and ignoring what got, goes on out there in terms of referees and everything like that. Um, you know, but. It, it is good to see Bud out there, you know, having our back, supporting us and everything like that. I'm proud he didn't get a technical. He, he towed the line pretty much perfectly. He had the emotion, the energy for us, and then, you know, it didn't really cost us anything. Well, along those lines, I mean, yourself, Grayson, I think Giannis, all of you had three fouls early. What, in games like this where it is that tight and it does affect your minutes and how long you can be out there then to affect the game, how, how difficult is it? to stay composed and to, and then obviously when you gotta come in, you gotta play and not maybe play as physical as you Yeah, play. yeah, it's, it's really that mental game I was talking about earlier. And uh, yeah, I think our guys did a great job of it tonight. And you know, um, you have to find that balance, you know, be physical, be smart, be there for your teammates um, and make sure you're not putting yourself in a position to where you could, you know, pick up a, a bad one, but at the same time being there to play great defense or make the right play or whatever it is, you know, offensive or defensively. Um, and so, yeah, again, so much about, you know, the playoffs is obviously mental. You talked about that kind of final sequence there. Was there at 
Did you know as soon as the horn went that the basket was late, or was there any nervous moment when you saw the ball go through the net? I, I had a pretty good view, and I thought it was close. You know, uh, I, you know, I uh, saw I'll tip it. You know, it was right there. I saw I'll tip it, um, and then I saw the, uh, you know, little red outline go off uh, on the backboard. So it was very close. You know, I couldn't even in that moment. You know, I don't know which way it was. Why do you think you guys had so much success guarding Tatum tonight? Um, you know, it was a group effort, but at the same time, you know, Wes was absolutely phenomenal. You know, uh, you know, he's just doing Wes things out there um, and making things difficult for him. But uh, you know, Tatum does a good job too of uh, you know finding his teammates when they're open. We had a lot of focus on him, obviously, and, and he does a good job of finding his guys, sharing the ball with his team, and. Uh, I thought uh, a lot of guys on their team stepped up, you know, even though he wasn't scoring tonight.